Oh man, we're getting ready to go to Atlantic City. I can't wait because Atlantic City is always a great place to party and DJ at. The whole crew's here except one fool. I look at my Blackberry and I get the email. The guy that was supposed to show up and work with me tonight hits me up and tells me that he ended up with the mailing list girl. Out of all the things you can hit out there, why you gotta go for that? The mailing list girl is gonna fade away. <laughs> You gotta get an ugly mail in this girl so nobody Jimmy. wants to hate it. Dude, he likes the whole allure of an industry girl. Even if she's just a mail in this girl. She has nothing to do with industry. That's whack, dude. Hey, you know what? They're not safe, they're not safe. I don't feel good about that. I've done this party before in Atlantic City at Providence. Um, so it's a good energy crowd, it's an easy crowd. It's a simple crowd. These are people that come to party at Atlantic City, which means they don't, most of these people don't live here. And they're here just for the weekend. Some are here for bachelor parties. Some are here for, for birthdays. These people, for the most part, are nine to five workers. They don't party that much. And when they do party, they party hard. Good times, high energy. It's easy. I don't know what is going on. These alarms are going off. I gotta get the crew together. We gotta pack up, get the other half of my money, and get out of here. Because this doesn't look good. And it's to be aggressive, like, dude, nobody gets punched in the eye, <laughs> nobody gets hurt, like, you know what I mean? Yo, Fifth, what's up? Hey, yo, yeah, what's up? It's Fifth, dude. Yo, enough, I needed to talk to you, I wanted to ask you about, uh, this radio station thing. I got this thing where, you know, I need to get the coolest radio personalities involved because I think it could be big, you know what I mean? I just I just need your guidance. I need you to help me in some areas to help me get the right guys. I, I'll give you the details on everything else when I get face to face with you, but I just need, you know, to know that you're on deck. You can still do everything you do at Hot 97 all other places and still, and it still work. Okay, cool, perfect. All right, cool. All right, I just wanted to make sure. All right, so I'll hit you back later. All right, bye. All right. Opening up for 50 for his 50 Fest concert. He's got everybody in New York coming out and performing. The weather's great, the crowd is definitely exciting, and I'm ready to have a good time. Yeah, he's at 6.30. Now we're waiting now. Jim Jones and Joel went to the Manhattan side, but they were supposed to go to the Brooklyn side. So now Fifth is over there on the Brooklyn side waiting for them to get over there. And there's gonna be a half of them. Jimmy got 30 people and Joel's got 18. 50's in Brooklyn. He's got some artists with him. And then I think like Jim Jones and Joel's are on the Manhattan side. So we had a little miscommunication. So hopefully Jim and Joel's can catch up with Fifth of them in Brooklyn and all come on the ferry at the same time. I'm nervous. Like, you know, you want to make sure everything happens smoothly. Like, all these people pay their money. You want to make sure you take care of the, the consumer. You want to make sure that these people are happy. You want them to leave this island knowing that they had a great concert. We have like one or two opening acts here, but that's it. The majority of all the acts are on that ferry. Jim Jones and the whole entire Dipset family made it, but still no 50. Now I'm getting nervous. And when I get nervous, I smoke. And smoke. And smoke some more. I just got on stage. I'm trying to stall the crowd. Right before I'm getting ready to break the news that 50 ain't here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 
50 Cent shows up. Woo! Fifty Cent shows up. He rocks the crowd, and it's crazy. It's mayhem. The island's going crazy. It's a roar. We're having a great time. Oh, thank God! I didn't know what the hell to tell these people. Hi, ladies. Things are a little tight right now, so I gotta come see my accountant and see where I'm at with my money. How did the tax thing work out? Tax thing worked out well. We went over the numbers the other day. But we still have other stuff to do on that. Yeah, like prior years. Prior years. We have communicated to the IRS that we're on top of it, that your prior, you know, prior accountants didn't get things done, so we're doing it and we're taking care of it. So I can still go to jail. No, you're not going to jail. I definitely, definitely don't like jail. Like, I already have my package buried of clothes, money, passport, everything. Are you going back to the shoebox? I'm just saying, I'm ready to go. I'm not going to jail. Okay, well, first of all, it wouldn't happen like that. Yeah. You're good where you are now. I mean, you're definitely good. You're a saver. You're smart about things. So you're good. You're in a good space right now. We have, you know, reserve money if there is our tax bills due. All right, so now how do I, with certain tax issues and... <clears throat> partner issues yeah. and trying to move other businesses along. How do I move money around to make this happen? You have to replace the income that you lost from MTV. Okay. All right, so more income. I should get more DJ gigs. DJ gigs don't pay like they used to, so now I got to get more of those and be up early for work. I have a complete faith that you can do that. Maybe we should do like a bake sale or something. Car wash? <laughs> A bikini car wash, I was just thinking that. All right, I'm gonna go back to work. Sounds good. Because I have to make more money. Yep. What's that MTV <laughs> flop? Where are you guys going? I'm walking you out. Oh. Like I always do. I was gonna flirt with Lisa for a little while. You can flirt with Lisa as long as you want. Yeah. I'll allow it. I, mean, I feel awkward now inside the work. <laughs> Oh, you want me to leave? I okay. can't flirt with Lisa when Goodbye. you leave. Goodbye. <laughs> it was good to Thank see you. you. Bye. I'll see you later. Think she likes me? Think she heard me?